Okay, I'm going to cover off if there's any bugs in the Elemental Flex container. Now, please bear in mind, I think the Flex containers are brilliant and they really allow you to be a lot more creative in how you do your layouts. I think they're fantastic. Go and watch our videos on that. But are there any bugs that we need to be aware of that just need to be ironed out? Let's have a look at them. Now, slides. Someone reported an issue with this, so I'm going to have a quick look at this. Right, so we've got slide one, we've got slide two. And then we got slide three. If we go to slider options, let's make it super quick. Let's put it onto 1000, okay? Um, and if I update that, and I'm actually gonna go back to slide one, and I'm gonna give this a background image. I oh, will go for all this image over here, and we'll leave it like that. Let's just go over here. So, so far, slide one, slide two, slide three, they're coming through okay. I am not seeing any issues there. If we go here as well, now then, slide one, it looks a little bit weird there. So let me just adjust it because I think that's now going to be the padding I've applied. So let's just get rid of all of this padding, okay? Let's just do that for now. Sometimes the stuff you set in it can make it look wrong. So look, it's now then the text. Did you notice the text? Now, is that because I've set my speed to be too small there? So let's go to slide option here and let's make it be 100 in terms of transition. Now let's make it be a uh, two and a half thousand, so two and a half seconds in terms of speed. Let's update that. Let's go back over here and now just check the words should appear. And all of a sudden, we're not getting the words. So there's our first bug with the slides. Okay, so let's go back over here. I'm now going to say um, uh, we are going to have content animation none. So if I now update that, and I view it now, slide one, slide two, so the wording does appear. So we've got a bit of a bug here at the moment. So content, let's just have it as um, coming down, okay? And we'll have it as a fade instead. Does that work? Again, the wording is not appearing. If you've got your slides and you're viewing them on a mobile, you are gonna find a problem. Well, that's kind of not great, is it? So I hope that gets sorted out. Got media carousel. I mean, look, that, that, that's kind of doing what it needs to do, to be honest. Um, I'm more interested in, though, in the mobile. Yeah, and that is working. Let's just check the slide effect is working automatically. It's kind of taking more than one second, isn't it? I would have expected it to be quicker, but hey, look, it's working fine. Testimonial carousel will be moving every second, which it is. Now then, the testimonial carousel has a bit of a problem, I think. So let's go back to, did you notice it's fine on the desktop, but on the mobile, it doesn't seem to be working. Can you see it is not showing anything? And that's a little bit of a, a, a bit of a, could be a problem here. So let's have two. Let's now have one. Okay. Uh, image in line, alignment center. The speed is fine. Let's update. So if you've got a testimonial carousel, does this now mean that it's not going to work? So there we go. We've got that image I added in there. We go over to the mobile. It see, it's like it wants to appear, but it's not appearing. So there is another bug. So we've got a bit of a pattern going on here at the moment. The uh, slides for the, um, the uh, where were we? Where were we? Where were we? The slides over here, we had a problem. We've now got a problem with the testimonial carousel. However, the media carousel seemed to be fine from what I could tell. But I'm going to just drop in an image now just to double check. It is definitely okay. So let's update. Let's just go over here. So that is fine. So the testimonial carousel, which is one of my favorite widgets elements because you can be so versatile with it, and the slides, there is a bit of a glitch going on here. So I hope that's already being looked at. Anyone here who then says, oh, but it'll be due to your other plugins. There's no other elemental add-on on here. There's no optimization plugins enabled on here. There's no minification of JavaScript, CSS, or anything going on on here, okay? This is just straight out the bat. What about image carousel? So the image carousel may, again, also show that problem. So let's just do that. And, and there you go, look none of the images are appearing. I, I'm not sure it's working correct because look, I've said show me three slides and these images have been cropped down to size by the way. You only have one arrow but you're not seeing the other arrow. I'm going to just make the arrows be really, really big. 
in terms of uh, the style. So I'm going to make the arrows be ridiculously big and we're going to make them be a dark color because look, it's just not there. In fact, if I can you see here, look at this. Oh, what's going on there? Can you see that? There's a scroll bar there. What is that all about? So let's just go over here to the container and let's make the maximum width be uh, 100. That's a maximum width of 100 and there'll be no uh, overflow. So it's just, I mean, we'll even put it as a column. We'll center everything out as well. Let's update that. So there is, I think, like I've already identified with the sliders, the testimonial carousel, and now with um, the, what are we on? We're on the image carousel, aren't we? I actually forgot to cover off three areas. So I've just shoved this bit in to excuse the lighting difference, okay? We've got the tabs, the accordion, and the toggle. So over here, I have the accordion. Over here, I have the toggle. And over here, I have the tabs. Now, in the, um, uh, in the normal like desktop version, they look fine. When you go to the mobile, though, if I shrink down the accordion, can you see what happened there? It's completely compacted in on itself. If I do the same with the toggle, right, it's, it does the same there. And if I close, well, the tab doesn't really change because the tab does always one open. But the accordion and the toggle, when you expand it, it expands out. Um, but when you're on like, um, look, I mean, look, this is, this is quite weird. When you shut it all down, they go in like that. So let's just explore that for a moment. Let's go over to this um, flex container. If we go to the layout for this, okay, for the items, this is set as a column, all right? If it was set as a row, it would go like that. So I've got it currently set as a column. The, the alignment is center and the justify content is center as well. So this is kind of a little bit weird, I think, in terms of what it's doing. If I was to go over here and I said uh, stretch the items instead, then we don't have that problem. Right. So there is a solution for it. I want to get that across. There is a solution. However, you have to ensure that rather than you saying flex star or flex center or flex end, you need to stretch it to make it work accordingly better there. Um, however, if I was to go, I'm just going to test something out. I'm using you all as a guinea pig now. If I put this back into the center and I go over to the accordion that we have here, I go to advanced. I have the align as well. So I've got flex start, flex end and all that. If I do stretch now, it's now working fine. So in some way there, you've got to remember that if you put in your, um, your accordion or your toggle, make sure you've either stretched the container or you have stretched the item. Otherwise, you're going to have this quite annoying thing where it just kind of shrinks in on itself. Um, I hope you like, subscribe, share and follow. The flex containers are great. There's just a bug. Remember, it is in alpha testing. It's not the final, final product to come out. But I hope they sort this out. But I would still say go and play and have fun with the flex containers because they are very, very versatile in what you can do with them in terms of layout. Take care and I'll see you soon. Never break, always fight, never quit. Do it right, play the game, win it life. Have no shame, there's no time for the pain. Let the grind, I could change in my mind. Pick a lane, commit and climb. The only way to win it life. I never miss that stack. Taking big swings, dish hand me the back. Put me in the ring, you'll go out in a bag. Cause I sing what I mean.